Hi, my name is Elisa Schneider and today I'm going to show you the bomb drop. If this trick comes to you later, share your results in Instagram using the hashtag BoldDreamOnline. So, let's go! First, let's remember the static elements that will be the initial and final position of the drop is the bird and the bomb. If you are not familiar with the bird trick, watch the video tutorial number 9. To perform the bomb, do the bird and lower your body down in front of the pole so as to approach the knees as much as possible, you can even hug them. Do not move your body away from the pole in the bomb, lower it straight down, you should feel side grip in this element. Repeat the transition from the bird to bomb on both sides, remember these positions. Now let's go on to the preparation for the drop, slide down in the bird. Perform a basic climb and the bird trick, feel the grip of the hips, side and armpits and additionally grasp the pole using your outside hand just below the armpit. Now your task is to slightly loosen the grip of the legs, but in any case don't open your hips to the sides, you have to touch the pole all the time. Try to slip down in this position and stop squeezing your hips more. The distance of your slides at the beginning can be just a couple of centimeters. Increase distance from the initial to the final position only if you are sure in your grip and feel when to stop. Try not to hold the pole with your outside hand too much, just only for insurance. And remember, your body does not move away from the pole or to the side or back, keep it in its original position. If you have very good grip, then you might not be able to slip down, but that's ok, just go to the second stage in this case. The second stage is mini drops, still in the bird position. Now your task is to loosen the grip between your hips more, you can even slightly open your hips to the sides now and immediately squeeze them back. The most important thing at this stage is the speed of changing positions. You don't have to perform the drop amplitude immediately. Start with a small, barely noticeable distance, so that you can repeat the movement several times from the top of the pole. It's better to stop at least a meter from the floor, come out from the move and repeat again if necessary. It's important to move in increasing the distance of the drop slowly and carefully, because the speed of the fall is quite fast, and if you immediately try to fall below, you cannot calculate the distance. Therefore, it's important to practice the second stage of the small drop slides. Next, try to perform the mini drop without the help of your outside hand and then gradually increase the distance of the drop, if necessary first again helping yourself with the outside hand. Train this drop from the bird to the bird on both sides. Next, you can train the drop from the bird to the bomb. For this, you need to change pose in the process of sliding down and in the future dropping, change the position of your body and arms. First, try to do this during the small drop, start to lower your arms and body down to the knees and hips at the same time as the start of sliding or dropping down. Note that the basic position of the legs does not change, but the element is complicated due to the fact that you lose the armpit and a little the side grip, so be careful when starting this drop. And again, carefully and slowly increase the distance of your drop. Practice the drop on both sides, making several attempts on both sides at the stage at which you are now stopped. If necessary, use some products to improve your grip, wax or magnesia depending on your skin type. This element is better not to do with bad grip, it might be even dangerous. So progress gradually and carefully and eventually this move will come to you. So today we have learned how to do the bomb drop. Wish you all the best in your trainings and see you soon. Bye!